Welcome to the first video in the webinar series on the Certified School Edge Child Care Centers. In this video, we are going to give a brief introduction to the new School Age Only Certified Child Care Center rule set and include some basic information to get us started. There are a total of 13 videos in the series. The remainder of the videos will review content from different sections of the rule book. We hope you find them helpful as you are learning about the new rules. However, not every rule will be covered in this video series, so please refer to the School Age Center rule book for the full list of requirements and rules. Hi, my name is Christina Christian. I am a regional manager with the Office of Child Care for the Tualatin Field Office. I work with a team of 12 licensing staff that support and license child care programs throughout Washington, Tillamook, and Clatsop counties. I have been in the field of early childhood for over 32 years. I started as a teacher's aide at a local preschool in Eugene and was an after-school site director. Over the years, I've held many different positions and worked for many different organizations, which has brought me to where I am today. I am proud to be helping support programs through child care licensing. This video series was created as an introduction to the rules for certified school age child care centers in Oregon. These rules fall under Oregon's revised statutes chapter 329A for child care. The rules were passed in June of 2022 and become effective on January 1, 2023. The school age center rule set applies to child care centers that only care for school age children meaning children ages 5 years to 12 years of age. This rule set was developed with the feedback from many school age programs to meet the unique needs of programs that care only for school age children. These rules do not apply to any licensed centers that also provide care for children under the age of 5. Programs that care for children under the age of 5 will continue to operate only under the certified center rules. As with any revision or change in rule, the Office of Child Care is here to support you, your staff, and your program. We want to help you be successful with implementing the new rules. Please reach out to your licensing specialist or another member of your child care licensing team if you have any questions. We are truly here to help. During each video, we will explain some of the key features of the School Age Center rules. You'll see that these rules are organized differently to help make information easier to find. This video series is just an introduction meant to call out the changes in rules and call out any new rules as well. We hope you find these videos helpful. Please refer to the School Age Center rulebook for the full list of requirements and rules. What are the Certified School Age Child Care Rules? A new set of rules that applies to centers that only care for school age children. Centers that also care for younger children must continue to follow the Certified Center rules. The purpose of these rules is to protect the health, safety, and well-being of school-age children when cared for outside their own homes with requirements that are appropriate for a center that provides care for school-age children only. This new rule set can also be found on the Oregon Secretary of State website under the Oregon Department of Education Early Learning Division Chapter 414 Division 310 Certified School-Age Centers. They can also be found on the Early Learning Division website at www.oregonearlylearning.com. On the previous slide, we mentioned the Oregon Administrative Rules, commonly referred to as the OARs. During this video series, we may refer to a specific rule number or section within the rules. Let's take a few moments to learn what the OAR numbers mean. Let's use 
0.0190 as an example. On this slide, you can see this number highlighted from the content section of the Certified School Age Only Rule Set. The first part of this number is the agency chapter number. In this example, 414 refers to the Early Learning Division. All of the child care rule sets start with the same number, 414. The second part of this number is the division number, 310. In our example, 310 tells you that this is the Certified School Age Child Care Rule Set. Each Early Learning Division rule set has a unique division number. On this slide is an example of just a few of the ELD rule sets. All rule sets are also located on the Oregon Secretary of State website. The website is listed here on this slide. Please feel free to take, make note of it and visit the website at your convenience. The third and last part of the OAR number is the specific rule section of the rule set. In our example, 0190 is the rule section that pertains to children's records for certified school age only centers. You can see the example here on this slide. The number 0190 is for children's records in the certified school age child care rule set. However, if you were looking in a different rule set, for example, certified centers, you would find them under a different section in the rule book. What is a school age child care center? The school age center rules define school age center as a child care center that provides care only for school age children eligible to be enrolled in kindergarten or above in the next school year and which does not include night care. This is an important distinction. Night care means care given between 9 p.m. and 5 a.m. or when any enrolled child sleeps for more than three hours at the center. When are the rules effective? The school age center rules will be effective on January 1, 2023. All currently licensed programs that care for school age children only will be transitioning to the school age center rules. These programs will receive a printed copy of the new rule book in the mail in late fall 2022, but before January 1, 2023. If you have not received a copy of the rule book, Please contact your licensing specialist and they would be happy to provide one for you. What do you need to do now? Well, first of all, please don't worry. Your program does not need to do anything before January. You will continue to operate under your current license until a new license is issued to you. In the meantime, continue reading the rule book watching the video series to learn more about the new rules. Remember that the Office of Child Care will work with you on the implementation of changes and provide technical assistance during the transition. Thank you for watching this video on the new School Age Center rules. You can now move on to the next video in the series. Be sure to check our website, www.oregonearlylearning.com, to check out the recordings from the School Age Certified Center informational Q&A sessions that were held in late November. As with any revision or change in rule, the Office of Child Care is here to support you, your staff, and your program. Please reach out to your licensing specialist or another member of your child care licensing team if you have any questions. We are here to help. Thank you again for watching and have a great day.